to J. La Prake, Second Epistle, by Robert Burns, April 21, 1785. While New Cadkai rode at the stake, and Pownies reek, in plew or break, this hour on Enon's edge I take to own I'm debtor, to honest hearted, old La Prake, for his kind letter. For rescuits are we, weary legs rattling, the corn out o'er the rigs, or dealing throw, among the nags their ten hours bite, my occart muse sir pleads, and begs, I would not write. The tipless ramfees old hissy, she's saft at best, and something lazy quo, she ye can, we've been sigh busy, this month, and mare, that drouth, my head is grown right dizzy, and something sir. Her douf excuses pat me mad, conscience says I, ye thoulous jad, I'll write an, that hearty blod, this very night, so dinna ye affront your trade, but rhyme it right. Shall bowled la prake, the king o' hearts tho, mankind were a pack o' carts ruse you sigh wheel, for your deserts, in terms sigh friendly, yet ye'll neglect to show your parts, and thank him kindly. Sigh I gat paper, in a blink and down gaid stumpy in the ink. Quoth I, before I sleep a wink, I vow I'll close it, and if ye winna, mac it clink, by jove I'll prose it. Sigh, I've begun to scrawl, but whether in rhyme or prose, or bath thegither, or some hodgepodge, that's rightly neither, let time mac proof. But I shall scribble down some blether just, clean f loof. My worthy friend, near grudge and carp, though, fortune use you hard, and sharp. Come kittle up your moorland heart we, gleesome touch. Near mind how fortune waft and warp. She's but a BTCH. She's gien me money a yurt and flag, sin, I could streetle or a rig. But by the LD, though, I should beg we, lie art pal, I'll laugh, and sing, and shake my leg, as langs I dow. Now comes the sax, and twentieth simmer, I've seen the bud upo, the timmer, still persecuted by the limmer frat year to year. But yet despite the kittle kimmer, I rob, am here. Do ye envy, the city gent, bet into kiss to lie and sclint, or purse proud, big we, cent per cent, and muckle wame, in some big bra to represent a bailey's name, or is't the putty, feudal thing we, ruffled sark and, glancing cane, what thinks him so nigh sheep shank bane, but lordly stalks, while caps and bonnets effortin, as by he walks. O oh, thou wa, geese us each good gift. Give me o' wit, and sense, a lift, then turn me, if thou please, a drift throw, Scotland wide. We, sits nor lairds I want a shift, in a, their pride. Were this the charter of our state, on pain o' hell be rich and great, damnation then would be our fate, beyond remed. But thanks to heaven, that's no the gate we learn our creed. For thus the royal mandate ran, when first the human race, began the social, friendly honest man, what here he be, tease he fulfills great nature's plan, and none but he. O mandate, glorious and divine, the followers o, the ragged nine, poor thoughtless devils, yet may shine in glorious light, while sordid suns o, mammon's line, are dark as night. Though here they scrape, and squeeze, and growl, their worthless nifu, of a soul may in some future carcase, howl the forest's fright, or in some day detesting owl, may shun the light, then may the law break, and burns her eyes, to reach their native kindred skies, and sing their pleasures, hopes, and joys, in some mild sphere, still closer knit in friendship's ties, each passing year.